FNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very cool Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. We've got a sea of red out there. All the U.S. indices that we track are trading to the downside. Dow's off 34 points, less than one-tenth of a percent. One-tenth for the S&P or six points, nearly four-tenths for the NASDAQ, 165 points there, 16 points for the Russell, eight-tenths of a percent move. Semis are off six-tenths. They're trading out at 43.61. You've got gold up six bucks with silver down eight pennies. Lights recruiters up a buck 78. Natural gas off 22 cents. And a 30-year treasury printed out at 120, 23. That's up six ticks. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel. Market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini, upper left-hand side. What do we know? Well, right now, when we take a look at this chart here, prices attain that one-to-one -one price projection level of that smaller A to B equals CD at 49.44. Its next price target would be 50.10. Spot volatility is trading below its 50-day exponential moving average. 13.59 is the level to watch today. A close below that gives buyers the edge. Close above it gives sellers the edge. In the NQ, it still has got it still has that road's momentum indicator top. That's at the 17, 793, 50 level. Price right now is dealing with its uh, the top of its daily profile. We closed above it yesterday. We're back below it today. It being 17,683. U.S. dollar index continues to run into that trend line resistance. Don't know if it's going to be able to take it out. So far, it has been been unable to. Goldilocks also dealing with a trend line resistance level there. Price of rally this morning right up into the sell zone. The sell zone for gold is between 2065 and 2076. Silver yesterday closed above the top of its daily profile. It's back below it today. If it can close back above it today, uh, today being uh, or the uh, profile level being 2321, call it 2322. If price closes above 2322 today, you'll have a profile change in trend, and that uh, may curtail that A to B equals CD to the downside pattern. However, you close back below 2321, that is absolutely still in play. Lights we crude. It's got a TD9 count top that only gets negated with a close above 7826. It all also has a new profile resistance at the 7794 level and support is between 7323 and 7391 natural gas yesterday closed below a prior swing point that was a td9 cal bottom not sure where this is headed to but it does look like it's headed lower and the 30-year treasury trading with inside its uh, bullish structured daily profile a close day above 12017 would be signaling its intent to move up to the 12315 level Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show, if you will. But if you're starting your Tuesday, have a terrific one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.